Hello there, and welcome to 1191 Lowell Avenue in Ben Salem, PA. Single family home, three bedrooms, one bath. Real cute neighborhood here. This direction I'm looking west. This direction I'm looking east. Very nice looking neighbor's houses. Very nice looking houses across the street. This is a cute house right here. And so is the one next door. A real long driveway here. You could park many vehicles in this drive. Got some trash in the driveway we're still getting rid of. Be out of here very soon. Here's the front stairs, the little deck, and the front door. You can see how big the yard is. Perfect for a pet. We're sitting out here with a barbecue. Currently don't have the key to the front door, so I'll just walk in this way. So you can see the siding, chimney. Don't power wash and should clean this up. This be a great house for a flipper. Here's the entrance into the basement. We'll go down there soon enough. Garage door. And a man door to get into the garage. Got power out here. And this garage has a big oil tank in it. Keep it out of the weather. Windows, electrical power. And it's got a second floor to it. Big enough to stand in. Windows on both sides. Pretty big, lots of storage. And whatever you want to turn your garage into. Here is the look of the driveway heading back to the street. Back of the neighbor's house. Looks really nice. Steps to the back of the kitchen. This is the house right behind you. Looks like it's well maintained. I'll just take a little walk around the uh, yard here. side yard. You can get a look at the house all the way to the front. There's our garage. So let's go in our kitchen. Take a look. So you walk up the steps and you enter into what would be the dining area. This is a big room. Probably the uh, you know, the nicest room in the house. So we got a kitchen. <clears throat> On this side we got a fridge, a stove. I'll give you a feel for how big it is. This is all your kitchen cabinet. And you have a lot of space here. Here's your kitchen cabinets. Nice open design. Big windows looking out into the backyard. It's a nice feel to it. And then here we have a large L-shaped living room. Get in the corner, give you a feel for it. Staircase going upstairs, a three-story house. This is like an entrance way here. This is the front door that I didn't have the key to. <clears throat> and over here is just a 
like a, an entranceway, foyer, or a mud room, whatever you want to call it, leading into the front of the house. This is the master bedroom over here. Pretty big bedroom. Window looking out onto the driveway. Those are 36 inch doors and it's a three door wide closet, so pretty big closet. And then the windows looking out into the backyard. Big bedroom. There's a small closet here in the hallway. Very small closet. Well, you put some stuff in there, vacuum cleaner or whatever. Here's our bathroom right here. We have one full bath in the house. And here's a toilet running. Obviously everything's going to need to be fixed in here. So we got a ceramic tile, a window. Pretty standard for a bathroom. I'll be hitting some lights on my way out of here. And we're back into the living room again. So let's go upstairs and see what she looks like. <clears throat> Master bedroom is on the first floor that we just looked at. And upstairs, we have two additional bedrooms. This is our hallway here around the staircase. And here is the biggest bedroom upstairs. We also have some attic space in here for storage and whatnot. This is our biggest bedroom up here. Got two windows looking out on the front of the house. Facing out onto the road. Closet over here. Back into the hall. Shut off the lights. And we have a much smaller bedroom over here more attic space over here this is a tiny bedroom but it could be good for a baby or a kid or somebody who doesn't need a lot of space like cats so that's the second floor let's go back down take a look at the lower level the basement I like this room. Here's our basement. So, this is uh, obviously not in good shape, but it was at one time. And I suppose, technically speaking, is right now a finished basement. Looks like they got a little fake fireplace. Could have been a man's cave for watching football games with his buddies. And here we've got, this is our water heater. If you take a look, it was installed on October 30th of 2015, so relatively new. Get some sheetrock work down here, flooring and whatnot. Over here, we just got a closet that goes under the stairs. Obviously, everything in this house needs to be fixed up. Could be a great flip. And then in this area, the unfinished part of the basement, we have our electrical panel, which is Looks like it was totally updated. Don't have a date on it. A couple of laundry sinks right here. A window over there. Here's our heating unit right in the middle of the room. And then over here we go through our door and we're back out onto the driveway.
This house is obviously need, in need of a great deal of work, but the world is full of a lot of flippers out there who would love to fix up a house like this in a good neighborhood in Ben Salem, 1191 Lowell. You can search this video on YouTube. There's my phone number listed by Addicted to Real Estate. Thank you very much.